Hello again, it's Mark Suderman. It is July the 3rd, 2015. We're in Fresno County, checking in for a third time on our Thompson seedless block. The water is on, we're borrowing from the neighbor, but this block has been treated with Ultra Grow Crop Shield in 21717, and in the course of the previous seven weeks has received only two inches of water. The vines are doing very well. The canopy is holding up, the fruit looks great, and as you can see, very little raisining. We're just going to kind of walk along here, I'm going to let you take a look. Now, I am on the southern side of the vines in an east-west planting. That's significant because that's the hotter side, tends to sunburn more. So as you can see on some of the leaves, there's a little bit, but not dramatic. So let's just kind of walk along here. Um, I can, let me just come to this other side so you can see that too. Here's the northern side of the neighbor row. Very little burn. Hey, some of you are wondering in this vineyard too, what kind of soil we're dealing with because some soils hold on to moisture a lot longer than others. So as you can see, we've got water running, but I want to show you, this is a very light soil texture. This is very sandy. You could almost use this for ashtray sand and it's very uniform across the whole ranch. As we're seeing a plant that's been empowered with good nutrition, to fend for itself, the phosphorus that's in that plant-ready form in the formulation of 21717 helps that plant manage its internal temperature and manage it well in order to cope with the stresses of the summertime heat. And keep in mind, we're coming out of verasion stage. So there's a lot of demand placed on the vine to fill fruit. And I'm sure we've all seen pre-raisining occur. Well, that tends to happen when you don't have enough nutrition at the verasion stage. Well, not a lot of that visible here. Adding the crop shield to that foliar spray application just helps the plant manage its evapotranspiration rate better. It's not a polymer, but it's a proprietary formulation that really just helps that plant manage heat stress and lessen the risks of sunburn. Now, it should also be said that we have two applications on here because we went over the four weeks for the first application, the pump's still not online. So like I mentioned, the growers made arrangements to tie his pipeline together with the neighbor and he's using his water. And so they've gotten a little bit of water but only two inches in the last two weeks and prior to that no water and so things look quite good the canes are coming along just fine doesn't look like we're going to lose any crop potential for next year but seven weeks with two inches of water anyway if you've got water challenges in your vineyard maybe you don't have enough to finish the crop well maybe you can get it up through verasion but then maybe just maybe you put something like crop shield 21717 on even if you've got to apply twice and you finish the crop, what's that worth? And I would suggest that that's a pretty good tool to have in the tool chest. So I wanted to share this with you. I appreciate you taking the time to watch. Thank you so very much.